What do you need to talk to me about, father? Well, son. It's time you learn about what the big boys know. You. Dad, it's fine. We already learned about it in PE. No, not that silly. I'm talking about rubber recycle. Rubber recycle? Why the heck do I need to know about that? Well, my boy, rubber recycle actually plays a big part in our lives today. How so, Daddy? Well, first I'll start off by telling you the backstory and the machine which allowed rubber to be recycled. Um, okay then, Dad. Hurry it up, I gotta check my Facebook. Dandy, so, the creator of Rubber Recycle, Thomas Hancock, was born in 1786 and died in 1865. His older brother, Walter Hancock, founded the Britain rubber industry. Thomas Hancock would experiment with all the rubber he had, to make things, such as waterproof gloves and coats. He soon realized that he was wasting a hefty amount of rubber. So he invented the pickling machine around 1844, which shred rubber and mashed it into blocks, so it would be able to be reused. Why was it called the pickling machine if it had nothing to do with pickles? I have no idea. Now shut your mouth boy and let me talk. So, do you see how important rubber recycling is now, son? No. Not really. The machine gave the world raincoats and stuff. Okay. Okay, Daddy. Thank you for that random information that I will most likely never use again. No problemo, son. Bye. <laughs>